Icon Pop from Stupid Raisins offers a set of 191 professionally designed and animated icon effects to make your projects stand out from the rest. Icon Pop was designed exclusively for Final Cut Pro. You can find it in the Titles browser under Icon Pop. There are 12 categories of icons to choose from, plus three helper backgrounds. Let's take a look at some of them. I've got a clip on my timeline that could use some icon pop. I'll attach an icon. On-screen controls allow you to position and rotate the icon anywhere you'd like. My shot is moving, so I can use the built-in motion tracker. I'll place the tracking square on the object I'd like to track and click the track forward button. Now I can move the icon while retaining the track. In the parameters, you can choose to include or disable a build-in and build-out animation by toggling the checkboxes. You can turn on or off the built-in animated text. This can be positioned and stylized separately from the icon. You can make each icon animate with a bounce, pop, or shake while it's on screen. Next, change the color the width slider controls the width of the stroke. Finally, there are drop shadow controls to help the icon pop off the background. That was so easy, why stop there? Let's add some more icons and track them to the camera movement. Icon Pop from Stupid Raisins is an easy way to add professional icon animations to your projects and is a must-have set of effects for your design toolbox. FX Factory offers a huge selection of great effects. And if you don't have them yet, I suggest you go try them out at fxfactory.com. Subscribe to this channel for more great videos every week.